What's good? I saw um, Gambino's family. Uh, yeah, check out Gambino family. You know, he got real good material. And he was talking about Kamala Harris. If you don't know who that is, that's who's running uh, the, the black woman, woman running with uh, Biden. She's supposed to be the vice president if you win. So I was looking at her. You know, I already kind of could judge her just by looks. You know, they, they pick these people for certain reasons. They ain't just like, yeah, she's a wonderful person. But what I found out is she was locking a lot of people up, like over 2,000 people for weed. Like some shit that just grow out the damn earth. Just locking people up for that. Something that they could just take, break up, and sprinkle it on the ground. You won't see it no more. Like taking everybody down. That's why she in there, because she's one of those people that's ready to do anything. You know, she's, she's going to do the most just to get her name and her complexion alone is fooling a lot of people. It's gonna be a lot of black women that's about to break their necks to get to the voting booths because they don't know no better. They about to break their necks, man. They about to go vote for this woman that says basically no to reparations. That's why she's in there because Biden is against it. He needed somebody like that to run, you know. Nick Cannon them sent him a uh, sent Biden a text out basically saying. If you don't get Kamala Harris or a, a, a black woman in there as vice president, you ain't going to get the black vote. Like, how, how Nick Cannon going to give somebody the ultimatum? Like, who the fuck is you? You just bow down and kiss my ass to the, the fake Jews, man. Get the fuck out of here, man. You ain't got no backbone. So, that lady, Kamala Harris, this devil, uh, Eastern Star, of course. They always come from the fraternities and sororities. Always. That's the good old boy gang. You know what I'm saying? That's why I always keep talking about that. Those the people that get pushed in front of our faces. Those are the fakes. You know? And these people, man, they, they don't mean us no good. This woman don't mean us no good at all, man. How you gonna be a black person and you ain't saying nothing about reparations? Like, shouldn't that be your thing? Like, yeah, th that should be her angle. But it's not. It's exactly the opposite. And she knew what not to say. She knew she couldn't say she was about reparations. She can't never say that out of her mouth, man. They probably killed that bitch. And I don't mean curse like that, but I'm kind of upset just thinking about how fooled these people about to be. You know, and then Trump, he playing checkers. What he's trying to do is get Kanye to run so he can... He can steal some of the votes from Biden because, you know, black people would like some black people would actually vote for Kanye and it would destroy Biden's um, while he running, you know, but it's just how they are, man. Just pay attention. They neither side no good, but the only thing good coming about with, with Trump's side is that that the child trafficking and all that stuff. He's trying to clear that up, you know, at least he's doing that. The Democrats get back in there, they, they gonna go adrenochrome crazy. They gonna lose their fucking minds. That's what they doing now. That's why all this stuff going on in the world, all these these bombs and stuff dropping all these new types of weapons that we ain't never seen before. You know, as soon as Trump made that black guy um, over top of the Air Force or whatever, the military, I don't know, but that's when it all started taking place too. And he told Trump told him, "Oh, you gonna love it, basically, because you gonna have you got a lot more new weapons than you had to than we had two years ago." So, when you seen that thing over in China look like a fire coming from the sky to, to burn that building up, that's the type of shit that they talking about. That's what they dealing in, in in some real stuff now. I mean, not to say that they haven't been. These people got beams and stuff that they using. You know that set shit on fire. They'll take it and bounce it off of the dome to where the, the destination is. Or what they'll do is they'll use a um, a plane. You know, a lot of those California fires will start like that last year, if I'm mistaken. But don't go vote. Don't do it. There's no point. There's no point, man. There's no point. It ain't even our fight right there. That's Gog Magog's fight. They at war right now.
we just so happen to be in the middle of it. So, who you voting for?